Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, today I'm going to show you a product review, or I'm going to do a product review um, on the Lunatic Tactic iPhone case. The aluminum and incredibly, incredibly strong iPhone case. Now, this case I actually got for $18 off of eBay. And it was the buy it now price, shipping in America. And I actually did a little bit of research on YouTube trying to find out the difference between fake lunatic cases and real ones. Um, what I found were that, or was that uh, the fake ones, the glass part of the screen, uh, was a separate piece. Um, also, the scribe up at the top that says lunatic was uh, painted on and not scribed in. This one seems to be scribed in, but I can't really tell, so it could be the paint. I'm not sure. Um, it also came in a pretty legit box. Don't really notice a difference between the fake and the real, um, with also two extra screws and the screw device. So, it's a pretty amazing case. Uh, the rubberized center portion has the cushioning on the sides as well as the silence buttons. A very nice rubber feel. It feels like the OtterBox rubber, like real OtterBox rubber, not plasticky. And then the titanium, or I'm sorry, the aluminum is very sturdy. Very, very sturdy. Um, the glass is a supposedly Gorilla Glass. Uh, polishing cloth and then the uh, toggle switch for your headphone jack. So it's pretty easy to put together. Um, the iPhone slips right in. Uh, mute button first into the case. Um, my only problem with it actually is the, uh, the battery compartment uh, blocker. It's a piece of metal shoved inside of a piece of rubber. So if you're a little bit rough with it, it's going to pop out. Um, if you open it a lot throughout the day, uh, it's going to pop out. You're just going to want to make sure to keep it nice and snug in there, and then when you handle it, just do it very slightly. Uh, the pieces fit together really nicely. Um, just the fact that it screws together uh, is, is really nice. As you can see, that piece fits into a snug piece of rubber at the bottom, but it's still kind of wobbly. Uh, you put the mute button on for the headphone jack. It's a little bit difficult to get the rubber to line up, but once you do, it fits together very snugly. And you can kind of hear the rubber snap once it's in there. And then it's six little screws. Now there is one problem I have noticed um, with it all put together. Um, is that when you screw together these center two here, a little bit too tightly, what's going to happen to the glass on the inside is it kind of folds right near the center here so it actually touches the LCD screen on your iPhone creating this sort of uh, bubble effect of like uh, rainbow in color. Um, and the only way and the way to fix that I've noticed is to just loosen this up um, just a little bit I mean or if, when you're screwing them in just do a little bit hand tight and uh, otherwise than that, I mean, I've had no issues with the phone. Dropped it a few times. Uh, nothing. It's dirt resistant, um, water resistant, not waterproof. So you can get water, you know, on it. Just don't submerge it. But, I mean, in comparison to $125 uh, for the actual case, I bought this, again, off eBay 
for 18 bucks. Now you just want to make sure to take a look at the pictures, um, see if they have a refund plan and all that stuff. But I mean, it's it's a great addition, and I don't think I'll ever use another phone. So um, just uh, when you're looking at them. Uh, if it looks like this, if it looks legit, if it looks heavy, if it doesn't look really fake, if they're not offering a bazillion colors of it or something like that, if it's just a single one for around 20 bucks, um, I would give it a shot. <laughs>